Hello, I am Emma Wilkins. This is my water sustainability report for BE170. So a quick introduction, water is the most essential resource, resource on earth. Water provides us food, electricity, and helps us maintain proper hygiene, which is why it is important that we preserve and sustain it as much as possible. Individual water consumption plays a part in sustaining water by analyzing and assessing the ways we consume water on an individual level, we can find ways to improve water consumption individually. My personal water use, I tracked over a two-day period. I consumed on average 58.95 gallons of water, which over the course of a month would be about 1,768.6 gallons and would cost about $2.07 and zero cents, or zero seven cents. For my water footprint for food, my I have a vegetarian diet, so my water consumption is pretty low at 492 gallons. In this assignment, the water carry assignment, we were told to carry a gallon of water with us. And I spent most of the day carrying around this gallon of water. I found it a bit of a struggle to carry around this water. So I, I praise the strong, capable woman whose daily task plays such an important role in their lives and the lives of their community who do this on a regular basis. In this assignment, business and industry water footprint, I was interested in looking into the water footprint of the company known as Levi's. Levi's is known for the high quality denim products, especially their jeans, as we all know. According And according to a Harvard study, it takes 10,000 liters of water just to create one pair of jeans. Some more sustainable practices I suggested were to have a water recycling system, to have a closed water system in which all the water they use to create their jeans comes back to them in their washing cycle, etc. To recycle cotton and recycle their jeans instead of creating new products from new cotton every single time. Also, of course, assessing infrastructure, ensuring no leaks as often as possible, and making sure they have water efficient appliances, and maybe not washing their products up to six hours. They say they do so in order to achieve that perfect Levi's look, but I think there could be an alternative way to achieve the look without wasting so much water. So my water consumption compared to that of my peers in the US varies. Um, as mentioned before, my water consumption averaged about 60 gallons per day. And my daily water footprint that I tracked was about 531 gallons. I think these numbers were different just because I tracked my actual water consumption on those two days versus the website I put all of my information to use the averages of the information to estimate uh, what my water would be, which can be very different. Compared to the class average of 40 gallons per day, my water footprint is larger. However, my daily water footprint compared to that of the United States average of 2000 is significantly lower. I do think people can influence others to make a difference in the water footprint of others. So in summary, water is an essential part of our lives that we can easily take for granted. I know I had up until this, up until taking this course, even though I knew to conserve water and take part in more sustainable practices, this class had further enlightened me to further my sustainable water practices through different activities, readings, and assignments. I have been able to reflect and fully recognize just how one individual takes part in water sustainability. And there is my work cited. Thank you.